everybody, welcome back to Jamia's promo, and today I wanted to show you guys my favorite hidden feature that's a part of Samsung One UI 3.1. Now, originally I noticed it here on the Galaxy S21 Ultra, and then after the Galaxy Z Fold 2 also got the latest update, I noticed it was sitting in there as well. So how you're able to find this feature is you wanna pull down the notifications panel either once or twice, and really what you're looking for is the word that says devices. Now, once you go inside of devices over here, you're gonna tap on this little snowflake little icon right there, and that is for your smart things. Now, if you have anything connected in your house that is a smart thing, you can set it up as a companion app. So companion apps, this is what is brand new on Samsung One UI 3.1. It's actually really cool. The moment you find this thing, uh, it's able to really automate your life, you know, depending if it's, you know, for the clock, calendar, or for smart view. Oh yeah, and if you guys are brand new here at the channel of Jimmy as Promo, we appreciate these tips, tricks, tutorials, and some of these hidden features inside of your Samsung Galaxy devices. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, as well as the bell for notifications to get notified for all future videos. And again, please, if you also appreciate this, give it a big thumbs up. You can even give it a thumbs down or write a comment. So this way, more activity, more thumbs up, will push this video to more and more audiences. So for example, for smart view, you can set the mood for smart view. So this way you can have supported devices such as your lighting or window treatment. Underneath calendar, you can get reminders for upcoming events on a TV or speaker. So you can set up your TV or speaker to you know, blast any type of announcements. But the one that I use here is clock. You can turn on lights or a TV when it's time to wake up. So this one has a little bit more functionality to it, more companion apps or companion devices with it. So you can turn on the lights or a TV when it's time to wake up. So supported devices would be a TV, the lighting, window treatment, air purifier, and air conditioner. So let's say you go through and you set one up. So inside of here, you just swipe down. And this is where you just set up your whole nighttime routine, the daytime routine, things like that. And one of the cool things is that you can also turn on this bedtime mode. So really, when you set up the bedtime that you would like to go to bed, that's really talking with this one right here. Uh, you can get a notification if you want to. So this one's just set up for 15 minutes before I set it uh, just as whatever was default. Now, in terms of waking up, I have this one set up for Monday uh, or Sunday through Saturday. And this is where you can set your regular alarm, but it's going to do more things with that alarm. So you can wake up with smart devices. So you just set up your alarm sound, how loud you want it to be, the tone it uses, if you want to have the vibration, the snoozes, things like that. And when you go through and you set up your days, if you notice that it is kind of turning this other purple, uh, basically white just means it's off. Uh, the, the circle and the purple color kind of means that it's turned on for those days. So how I have mine set up is that basically uh, I, for 7 a.m., the moment it hits 7 a.m. on my phone, it'll actually turn on anything that I have set up. Then right over here on the very bottom, this is what you're choosing, the smart devices you want to turn on when you wake up. So you control the smart things devices when an alarm rings. So once this alarm is going off at 7 a.m., it'll actually turn on my smart TV. You can also go through, you can change or select the TV if you have multiple TVs. You can turn on or off the ambient mode and you can also change the volume if you want to. But for me, it automatically turns it on. It's it's going inside of my, my Amazon Fire TV cube. So there's really nothing I need to do with the audio. So it makes it very simple. When I wake up, I'm able to make a bottle, go inside the living room, the TV is on, ready for us to, to you know start the day. And that's pretty much about it. And then you can run when alarm is dismissed. So let's say that maybe you're, you're gonna snooze one time maybe you snooze a second time and you don't want your TV or your lights or humidifier or whatever you selected and you don't want it to go on right away you're able to select this one here so once you dismiss that alarm then it'll actually turn on so if you're sleeping for an additional 15 20 minutes uh, this way you don't have to you know waste that electricity but usually I get up the first time my alarm goes off haven't really snoozed it that often so this right here uh, you know, once you once you set it all up with the whole, you know, wake up and, and go to bed. So again, you, you move this orange light right over here, uh, you know, for your for your wake up. This appears for your nighttime. Once you have it all set up for the days, uh, you got that all going. You, you connected your smart things. You hit on save and then you're good to go. Now, I already have one that is already set, you know, set up with this one right here. So uh, I pretty much don't have to save it. But yeah, that is it for today's video. That is it for the hidden feature that's a part of Samsung One UI 3.1. It's actually really cool. Again, you go right back inside of devices, you tap on smart things. Now, anything that you have connected as a smart thing, 
you just go inside of your companion applications. Uh, mine is set up for clock and then you go to set up and then you just basically set it all up as everything that we just got done talking about. But I hope you guys have liked this video. If you guys did, please give this thing a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to hit on subscribe. Subscribe right over here on the very bottom left hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you also like this video. And I'll see you guys later. Oh,